Hi, in lieu of a live stream today, I'm sending you this video very um, pre-recorded to explain why I haven't been in touch during uh, the last days of December and January because I had tons of people's emails about what they'd done in the previous year and, and it was actually quite interesting but I, it was very interesting but I couldn't bring myself to add my own uh, stuff to that so I'm telling you it now in January not quite mid-January well kind of mid-January 10th of January yes yeah, got to be the mid-January um, and this is just a report for you lovely supporters of my adequate projects and um, just to let you know mostly a couple of things have changed there is also a calendar. I did do a news thing about what happened last year and I got slightly bored, honestly. So I thought you'd be very bored too. But it is all in here now. If you if you click on Q2 over here in June, you'll get a summary of the first six months and then Q4 you will get a summary of the next six months. Um, I don't think it is actually boring, but it bored me to go on about myself. Uh, maybe I'll, I'll just have a quick look and see what's in there. Um, okay, so this is the page about the second six months. Just to show you, I separated each month into the four categories of attempting to write, speak, doing art and encouraging other people. So that includes teaching and coaching and just having chats and things. So these are the things from last year. There's a drawing class I did with my beloved Schnauzer Peanut. Peanut was very wet. We got caught in a thunderstorm just beforehand. And those people at the class are drawing Peanut, I think, at that stage. Anyway, so yeah, there are six months of stuff and some drawings and pictures and showing you how the website's changed. Uh, really pleased because this time last year I could not have done this thing with these thumbnails and these drawings and shown them in this way on my website. It might sound like the most incredibly prehistoric thing but maybe it is prehistoric these are drawings from a from a book launch i went to so let's see if i can no not that what do i want to do i want to swap over here pull that down a bit okay that's the photographer the thing anyway the thing is i've got these thumbnails now which i can click through to show you different pictures on my site. Gosh, it's confusing. There we go. So I drew those at the book launch of uh, Charlotte Fox Weber, and um, who I know, and who has actually also been a supporter of my work. So in the last, six, in the next, in the summary for the next year, looking ahead, what do I want to do? I've also broken that down into writing, speaking, making art, and sharing stuff. And under sharing stuff, this is where Adequate Projects is changing, probably most, I suppose, because I want it to become a rolling series of group workshops and courses, which are open to anybody, but people in Adequate Projects get 30% discount to say thank you for supporting my work. Um, and I'm going to do them live, and then I'll probably save them as recording so people can do them later if they pop along. Um... Yeah, so, but then I realised what I hadn't really put onto this page uh, because of my um, being torn up about wanting to share stuff and not wanting to share stuff, not go on about myself, but also say, hello, I'm here and these things are happening. Um, what I haven't particularly put on here is that actually a vast amount of my output has gone onto Instagram, if I'm perfectly honest. Um, so I haven't even mentioned that. And one of the other things that I haven't, particularly mentioned is that over the course of the last year I've done a lot of work with people on their writing. I've done um, work with individuals who are already, who've already been commissioned and paid to write a book and they just wanted extra support on the writing. And I've also worked with people who hope to get to that stage, haven't got there yet, on Arvin courses and this is the thing I want to show you, this thing here, if you go onto the page and click on it, and then click onto this thing with the, the book. You get your book done fast. 
I have been offering sessions to people on Calendly. Uh, 15 minutes of free help doing something with your book. Um, and that's something that I think is really valuable and I've really enjoyed doing it, actually, to be honest. I've found it incredibly um, reassuring to myself because it's interesting to see how I'm still dealing with all the same things that these people are dealing with. And also gratifying to know that because I feel like I've got the support of adequate projects, I can give this free help to anybody who signs up. And I should just say that in the last few weeks, because of my Psalms book and the flurry of publicity relating to that and an article I wrote for The Guardian, I've had a lot of people sign up for this one-to-one -one help. It's quite um, fascinating to see the variety of different projects. Um, so those are the things I thought I would mention. I thought I'd keep this relatively short and it's now been only six minutes. Did you know that they say on YouTube that you should go for ten minutes because that's like ideal. Longer is not brilliant. Shorter isn't brilliant. But I really hate having to learn these algorithms. I feel like I've spent the last, last ten years teaching myself how to use the equipment that these um, platforms have used and, and then they make you have to do you know, everything the way that they want it or they won't show it to anyone. Well, I don't care. If you've watched this far, that's brilliant. And it's only been 6 minutes and 36 seconds. Thanks for watching. Um, if you go on the page about modest uh, ad adequate projects, you'll see that I'm planning to do a lot of live streams to YouTube and I'm scheduling them Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays at 4.30pm UK time. And uh, if you subscribe to my YouTube channel or visit it occasionally, you might see more details and you'll see how to sign up if any of them grab you. I've put on the page, what have I put on the page? A very rough description of what I'm likely to do. Um, but actually, it's probably going to change a bit. So just it'll, it'll stay in three bits because I like to have the idea of writing, art and speaking on separate days. So that's the general picture. Thanks for watching. I don't want to stray into the area of being a 10 minute video because then you'd, you'd, um, you'd be overwhelmed with other people watching it.